on aloe vera demonstration. Okay, basically we have a range of uh, nutrition and as well as daily use products. So I'll start off with nutrition. Our first product is this thing called aloe vera gel. Most anyone never seen this bottle before? Actually, most people might have seen this bottle because this company has been around for 35 years. The first concept I will share with a lot of people is why do we need supplements? Why do we need? Some people say, I'm still young. Some people say, I, I mean, I eat very healthily. Why do we need supplements? I always share with a lot of people, if we want to have a healthy body, which comprises of 100%, there is a breakdown of this 100%. The first 25%, it goes out to our diet. Whatever you put in your mouth is whatever that will last in your body. Yes. So we are what we eat. You must control every of your diet at a moderate. And the next thing, next 25% is exercise. Who exercise three times a week? <laughs> Normally when we ask this question, hardly people raise up their hand. Uh. I wouldn't expect everybody to exercise every day. Uh, but at least one to three times a week. Uh. And each time more than 30 minutes. Some people ask me if I do household work at ho housework at home, uh, is it considered? No. <laughs> I, I don't say it is, uh, but if you really want to count in, then your exercise must be at least uh, a period of time. Uh. But the best is to go for some brisk walk in those nature parks. And the next 25% is on lifestyle. What is lifestyle? You smoke, you drink, environmental factors like pollution, all this, stress, all this will constitute to our lifestyle factors. And the last 25% is this thing called supplements. If today you are not on any diabetes medication, you are not on any high blood or high cholesterol medication, you are on the safe zone now. But that doesn't mean that you are not risk to having all this. So for prevention, you need some supplements. This is what we need already. You can tell me I can do very well in this, very well in this, very well in this, but you can never get a complete 100%. But in the market, there's so many types of supplements. There is the natural, there is the synthetic supplements. A lot of products will proclaim themselves as synthetic, but we always encourage people to go for the natural one. But how can you tell whether a product is natural or synthetic? You have to observe, and you have to know, and you have to read. So the first thing is, I will share with you how to look for products that is natural or synthetic. This is an aloe vera juice I bought from the pharmacy outside. This is the forever aloe vera juice. Firstly, I will get two glass of plain water. Okay. The first two glass is plain water. And then for the third glass, I will pour in some aloe vera juice that I bought from the pharmacy outside. I think this is the aloe vera juice that I buy, and this is the one from forever. Okay, my my friend here, I forgot your name, sorry. <laughs> what is your name? Ah? Ken. Ken, okay, Ken. By the look of this two, what is the difference? <laughs> This one is clearer, this one is actually more concentrated, right? Oh, people at the back, y'all can see, right? So one thing is that aloe vera is just like any fruits or any plants. Once you blend it under the blender, it definitely has pops like this. It will not be like this. This is what we term as synthetic man-made type of supplement itself. So the next thing, I will use this thing, it's called betadine. It's an antiseptic solution. When we drink this, <coughs> Cannot lah, you drink this, you need to go hospital already, okay? So one thing is that I will use this to represent as what? Well, as toxin our body absorb in. From where? Like just now I mentioned, due to the modern lifestyle and environment. Is it a bit blur? Or is it okay? Okay. okay? Can see ah? Okay. So imagine your body used to be so clean, but because of what? Environmental pollution, dependent on medication, bad diet, lack of exercise, work stress, smoking and alcohol, your body becomes like this. So at the initial stage, what happened? You start to experience like acidic body. What do we mean by acidic body? You wake up early in the morning, very tired. After lunch, you feel like sleeping, but in the night when time for bed, you cannot sleep. An immune system breaks down, start to have cough or flu, and then this talk dysfunction. Some people have constipation, gastric problem, or irritable bowel syndrome. And when you accumulate too much free radicals, it will lead to cancer. 
Okay. When we are a baby, you see our colon is very clean. So I use this Maggi noodles because it's curly in shape. Okay. I use this to represent just like a clean colon of baby. But as we start to absorb food, all these things, what happened? Our body starts to absorb as well. Okay. And then our parents will say, drink more water, water can be toxic. You see, water has its limitation, but we still have to drink eight glasses. This is the one from the pharmacy. Mm. No difference. And how about the one from Forever Living? <laughs> this is still very dirty. I point the whole of this X brand one. No difference at all. But I just point a little bit of this. Is, this is what we term as reverse oxidization. Meaning, when your body is very toxificated, very oxidized, just like an apple, when you cut, you leave it aside, what will happen? Brown. Yeah, it will turn brown. Can we still eat the apple? Yeah. Can, but it's just that not so nice really. Uh, some people prefer not to eat. Mm -hmm. Same thing for aloe vera also. Once you harvest it, right, within 48 hours, all the nutrients will also oxidize and gone. So, the first patent that forever has is this word you read here is stabilize. It's not just by writing here, you have to take a look here. We have two US patent to protect this product. So this patent is to say that all the aloe vera that we put in are being stabilized. So the nutrients are locked in. So when you drink, you still can drink the effect. And then the second thing, some people will say that aloe vera itself is very cooling. Have you heard people saying that before? Yes. yes, it is true. In between the leaf and the flesh, there's this yellowish set. It is poisonous. If you eat it, you get diarrhea. If you apply your skin, you get itchiness. If pregnant women eat already, might even get miscarriage. But why during my pregnancy, I still can drink forever aloe vera? Because we have the skin remover. To remove the flesh, we remove the skin just to get the flesh. So it is safe for consumption. Mm. So these are the two points because there's a lot of aloe vera products outside but this is the two points that Forever has itself that makes it uniquely different from the others. Okay? So, in summary, for this bottle of aloe vera, it has these eight ingredients. Why is these eight components very important? The reason is, a lot of supplements itself, right, it can replenish the nutrients but it cannot help you to clear off. So, the purpose of this aloe vera the first three components, lignin, saponins and antiochinone complex, is to do cleansing, to clear away the toxin inside your body so that your body can absorb. After that, it replenishes you with all this what? Like minerals. This is good for who? People with diabetes. Normally people with diabetes, they'll inject this thing called insulin. Okay? So in aloe vera, it has a mineral called chromium. It's an insulin booster to balance the blood sugar. That is why normally when we go through any health screening reports, when we see that the person has very high glucose level, right, we will ask them to take this to help to maintain the level. But likewise, if the condition is too serious, then they have to be stuck on the medication at the moment really. Supplement is to aid in the condition. Never ever take the supplements and say, oh, this one can cure diabetes or this one can cure. <coughs> supplements aid in the condition. Okay? Vitamins A, C, D, B complex, there's B12 that helps to create blood. So it's good for people with anemia. Like they squat down, they stand up, they feel very giddy. Ah. Okay? Mono and polysaturized, as you read here, it can provide energy and it helps to restrain on cholesterol. And enzymes help for digestion, so it's good for people with poor digestive system. And amino acids is basically to form our cells. So this is an overall very good health maintenance if you don't want to take supplements from A to Z. Just this thing will be good enough to cleanse your clone well really. Okay? Okay, this is the Guinness World Record oldest twins. So they share about the aloe vera that they take during an interview with the media. And for cat also, for animals as well, uh, for pets itself, they can also take this aloe vera to help to maintain their better skin and also for their health condition. Okay. And it is also one form of way for you to lose weight. But you don't go and tell a friend, hey, you drink this, huh? from this size, you lose to this size. <laughs> no, one thing is that all these things still have to work together. Yes. This lady, she was having high blood, high cholesterol diabetes. 
she tried many, many ways to lose weight, but she couldn't. So one thing is that when she was exposed to forever living, but not only just the supplements, she go through the diet, exercise and lifestyle. So within two months down the road, she lost about 30 kg. But for a lady at 85 kg, it is still very heavy on their knee. Mm. So what happened to her? She continued and... Wow. I saw a lot of people mouth open. <laughs> she eventually lost to 71 and to 58. But from here, well, it's the real person, uh, it's the same person, okay? No Photoshop. Uh. <laughs> from 114 to for 85 to 71 to 58. It, it confirmed cannot take just one, two months. Mm. It took her 11 months, close to one year. But most importantly, is the discipline uh, and then through uh, adapting a better lifestyle itself and with the help of the supplements to lead her where she is. And more, the, the weight never rebounds back and at least she's healthier, free from all the illness. Mm. Yes. Okay, so this is the first one for aloe vera. The second one that I'll be doing will be on our Dixie. I'll be doing will be on our Dixie, our Omega 3 fish oil. Okay. Maybe before I do, right, uh, just now I mentioned, uh, who haven't drink the aloe vera before? Okay. <coughs> Am I Dick? For new friends, first time here, uh, maybe a bit unsure. Okay. Before, because different people with different health condition, right? When you taste this, right, it will taste differently. Okay, so the next one that I'll share with you all will be this thing called Artixi, which is our fish oil. 
Let's talk about this problem called cardiovascular disease. In Singapore, out of five person, one person will have either high blood, high cholesterol, or diabetes. So out of here, at least about 30 people, there will be about six of you will having this problem. Okay? Mm -hmm. So imagine your artery used to be so clean. I use these two glass to represent a clean artery. Okay? But after that, it starts to have all these fatty deposits. Under the microscopic, so once you go in, you see from here, right? Half of your blood vessels is clogged. So what you will experience at the start is dizziness, tiredness, cannot concentrate. Some people will have high blood, high cholesterol, so a breathless and then stroke. Heart attack is all how it happens. It don't happen just within one month time. I will use this. This is called styrofoam. Do you know what is styrofoam made of? Don't know. Some say oil. Yes, this is made from the lowest grade of oil, from crude oil. Why I use this is because styrofoam, the molecular structure, is very similar to our cholesterol. I use this to represent the food that we like to eat. What are your favorite foods? All this good food. So now later you see all the blood vessels is blocked. So can you help me see which one has more styrofoam? <coughs> okay, this one has more styrofoam. So the one that he chose that has more styrofoam, I place it for the one for Arctic sea. The one that has lesser, I place it for this omega-3. Omega-3 is actually a very, very common fish oil found in the market nowadays. Okay, this is the omega-3 from the market. I mean pharmacy lah. Some people ask me market talk, but really market. <laughs> okay, pharmacy. So this is the fish oil. From Forever Living. Okay. It is this size, okay? So by the look of this, is there any big difference or not? Besides the size. <laughs> yeah, besides the size, but the color wise is about the same. So a lot of people will tell me fish oil all are the same. By the look of it, we cannot tell the difference. I'll pour in some warm water. Why do I pour in warm water? The blood flow inside our body is warm. If you don't believe, later you, when you pass your urine, right, you use your hand and feel. <laughs> your urine is definitely warm, huh? okay? So, I will cut this first. This is the one from the pharmacy. Okay, and then I stir it. And then I cut this from forever. And then let's see what happened. Ayo, the effect is too fast for really. <coughs> So fast. Smell is a lot different. You can see it. So it's wrong. This one, the styrofoam is still there, but this has already melted. Okay? You know when that time I did this, that one lady she saw, she asked me, Later I eat with my stomach made of <laughs> Don't worry, our stomach is not made of styrofoam. Our stomach is made of cells. This is just a representation where the good oil touch a bad oil, it will clear off. Or technically, we say when the saturated oil mixed with an unsaturated oil, it will clear off. Okay, so when choosing a fish oil, like there's so many fish oil in the market nowadays, right? How do you actually go about the find? Firstly, understand where does your fish oil come from. Forever is extracting the fish oil from this area called Arctic Sea. It is far away from pollution, the fish is fresher, it's healthier. The second thing is, you can never find the second fish oil in the market that has olive oil inside. So besides omega-3, we added in olive oil. What is the purpose of olive oil? It acts like a catalyst. Catalyst means it helps to speed up the process. So, given you take one capsule of this, it may be equivalent, you have to take about four or five of this to reach a similar effect. But as consumer, when we consume a supplement, what do we want to see? Yeah, effectiveness, how fast, right? If I say you have to eat under two years, then you can see the results. Who has the patient or want to spend the money on this, right? So if you have friends with high cholesterol, high blood pressure, right? Strongly encourage you to recommend them, yeah, recommend them this the aloe vera gel.
together with the fish oil, these two products. Aloe vera is to clear the colon, fish oil is to clear the cardiovascular. And the good thing is that forever fish oil also added in with this thing called calamari oil. The thought of calamari oil to you is what? Yeah, high cholesterol. How come put sotong inside? <laughs> right? Some people ask, how come put sotong inside? Like I say, salmon. Salmon is very good for the fish oil. But taking too much salmon, it will cause uric acid. Ah, so it doesn't mean that we put in the, the sotong inside. What we are extracting is the oil from the calamari. And then calamari oil has very rich DHA. You just go Google and check. Very rich DHA. In Singapore nowadays, a lot of people is having this problem, what we term as Chinese term as jing shen bing ah. Okay? Not shen jing bing ah. Not the gi la. I mean, jing shen bing means what? Mentally problem. Yeah, because due to stress, due to the pressure, like from work, from family, financially, all this. So that's why a lot of people undergo this type of anxiety. Taking a lot of DHA will help to calm our nervous system down and then to balance our whole body up. Okay? So this is the first two product that I share with you. And it's also good for people with like arthritis, leg pain. Yeah. So high blood, high cholesterol, arthritis, and it's good for the eyes and the brain. Okay. Okay, next. Next product itself is this thing called absorbent C, vitamin C. Have you ever asked why do we need vitamin C? Yeah, to build up our immune system. So there's many purpose that we're actually taking vitamin C. But the main reason why do we take vitamin C is because human cannot create vitamin C. Okay? In the whole world, there's two types of animals that cannot create vitamin C. One is human, one is the gorilla chimpanzee family. The rest of the animals, they can self-create vitamin C. So, and... The other thing is that because it helps for all this fatigue, weak appetite, <laughs> uh, bleeding gums, muscle weakness, and depression, and all these things. So same thing here. I'll have two glass, and I'll pour in one with water, and I'll use the betadine also. Use this to represent what the toxin, uh, toxin that our body absorb from the stress and all these things. Then I'll pour to be on the equal side. Okay? Yeah. Then in the natural world, you all know what is this? Lemon. Ah, lemon. Lemon is said to have the highest vitamin C on the, of fruits ah, so far that's found on the market itself. Ah. So one thing is that I'll use this lemon to represent. Some people say, you know, I, I don't I don't need synthetic supplements. I, I take natural, I take fruits and vegetables every day. Let's take a look at this. Ah. I'll use my Lemon loses its effect already. 
But as you can see, you can This as you can see, even if I put aside for about three hours later, I continue to put. It is still able to cleanse off. Okay. And the next question I will say is that, do you think even by giving fruits itself, you can eat how many lemons a day? <laughs> right. Okay. Yeah, it's too acidic already. It's too strong for our stomach already. So when eating this, right? You all will taste that there's like an oak brand like thing, right? There's a green light thing inside, right? It is oak brand. Forever supplements itself is very natural. This is obviously there's only four things inside. Papaya, honey, oak brand, orange. This four items itself inside. So the purpose of the oak brand is to lock the vitamin. So as and when your body needs it, then it will release out. So one uh, tablet of this absorbency, it can last in your body for about three hours. Unless your work pressure is really a lot or unless you're the type who bend and girl a lot. So if your boss wants to scold you, don't need to talk back, say take this first. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so Christmas is coming, you can buy this for your boss, okay? <laughs> and then the next question is some people will ask me, you see, forever absorbency is only what? 60 mg. In the market, mostly it's what? 500 mg or even 1000 mg. If both selling at the same price, most consumer will buy which one? <coughs> yeah, 1000 one are cheaper at the more. But according to research, at one time, our body can only absorb 60 mg. If you eat the 1000, what happened to the 940? It will flush through your kidney, pass mm -hmm. up as urine, ah, because vitamin C is water soluble. But the second question is, if your water intake is not enough or your kidney function is not that well, it's not able to flush up, it will stay in your kidney and form kidney stones. So that is why supplements, you have to really go for natural. Don't just because, oh, cheap. <laughs> <laughs> no, you have to understand what you are buying, okay? So as a health maintenance, these three products will be really good enough. Then this, as obviously, I also got one testimonial to share. That time, uh, because I have a friend, she was pregnant. So when she's pregnant and she had the flu, she cannot possibly, she, well, she don't want to eat medication because she don't want to harm the fetus. So I gave her 10 tablets of this. You can eat up to 10 tablets a day, no problem, or even more. So long as like you feel that your immune system is going down. So she took 10, but spread out 3, 4, 3. And then the next day, her flu stops already. So this is a really a very good. So if you feel that you are experiencing flu soon, or your immunity is going to break down, or your workload is too much, you can just take a lot of this. No problem to that. Okay, and children can also take this. Mm. Okay, so this is the first part for the nutrition already. Next area we will be touching on will be the daily use product. What is the first thing that all of us do when we wake up early in the morning? Check message, <laughs> check email, <laughs> check Facebook, right? <laughs> so, but ultimately, every one of us will brush our teeth. Who never brush our teeth today? <laughs> okay, so when brushing our teeth, we need one pail of water. And then, I'll use this CD case. What is this CD case? Okay, this CD case itself, is made, this is made of acrylic. Okay, why I use acrylic? Because our teeth, there is a protective layer, which is what we call as the inner melt, phalanxi. Okay, that is why a lot of people, why they start to have sensitive teeth is because once the inner melt get rubbed off, it will get thinner and thinner. It will never grow back. Not like our skin. Once you got a cut, it will still grow back by itself. Yes. So when people start to develop sensitive teeth, when they take cold drinks, they take hot drinks, they will start to feel the sensation pain already, and that's where people start to look for sensitive toothpaste okay but sensitive toothpaste the good news is that you won't feel the pain but the bad news is that it is only something that we put inside is to numb your nervous system you will still have the sensitive teeth if you stop using the toothpaste ah a lot of people don't know this oh, uh, the problem will be solved no it's not true so over here i mine is real teeth so i cannot take up <laughs> i use this okay so this is x i'll do it over here to represent the X brand, and this is F, I'll do it over here, to represent Forever Living. And, I searched for many brands, but I realized that this brand, nobody knows what it is. So I choose this one. Okay, and then, this is the one from Forever Living. Uh, so, over here, I put this X brand. Okay? And then, over at the bottom here, I put Forever Toothpaste. Hey, some people see already. Yeah, 
come green in colour? Is it spoiled? <laughs> no, it's not spoiled, oh, don't worry, okay? Later I'll explain why is it green in colour. So when we start to brush our teeth, we will definitely rinse, yeah, rinse our mouth. Okay, then we start to brush our teeth. Just a quick check. Uh, how long do you spend brushing your teeth? Miss, how long do you spend brushing your teeth? Why? Why? A few minutes, a few minutes. How about the two girls in the middle? Oh, you brush two times yeah. up. Okay. How about you, this lady? Five minutes after class. Wow, oh, not bad. <laughs> no wonder your teeth is very nice. <laughs> okay, but a lot of people who, especially those who never answer, you know why they never answer? Because they use less than 30 seconds. <laughs> okay, a lot of times, because why? Sleep even not enough already. You still, still brush your teeth so long. But according to dentists, uh, the correct way you have to brush your teeth at least three minutes. Okay, then how many times you gargle your mouth? Three times? Four times? Okay? Two times? Two mouths. Two mouths. Two mouths full of water only. But by right, you should actually do it eight glass of water. Huh? To be thoroughly clean. That is why sometimes after brushing your teeth, if you use your tongue to lick, what is the taste? Sweet. Sweet ah. Ah, because the toothpaste is still inside. Okay, so we finished brushing our teeth already. Then we will what? Speed off. Okay, and then I will speed this off. Okay. Okay, and then we will start to rinse our mouth again. And let's see. I never want clean up. I really want to very clean already. Okay? You see this thing? <coughs> what is this? There's actually a mist here. Okay? Cannot, cannot rub away. Y'all can try to rub away. What is this mist? Okay? In this type of toothpaste, uh, in this type of X brand toothpaste, it contains something what we call as the abrasive agent. All these are what? Sharp agents. Every day, they will rub against your inner mouth. So your inner mouth will get thinner and thinner and thinner. That's how sensitive starts to develop. And the second thing is that, in this type of toothpaste, not only with this problem, it also contains one thing called fluoride. Ah, I don't know what your, what do you know about fluoride? What is the purpose of fluoride? <laughs> yeah, to kill germs, right? Yeah, but like some, some of you all say that this is not good. But why is the reason not good is that fluoride itself is a slow cancer causing agent. I'm not saying that you use this to brush your teeth, you will get cancer, okay? But it's just an accumulation. Why is it so? This is a book I bought from Malaysia. This is the Consumer Association of Penang, okay? So this book talks about cancer-causing chemicals in cosmetic and daily use. Because in Malaysia, the cancer rate suddenly shoot up to 496%. And many of them, they are not having any bad habits, like they don't smoke, they don't drink. But how come they develop? So they do a research that is actually through the daily use that they are using. And what shocked me most is that when I saw this thing called toxic toothpaste. Okay? Toothpaste. Everything, everything we are putting this. And then, next is, to your surprise, is this any brand that you are using? Yeah. <laughs> oh. Okay? And not only this, actually what shocked me most is because I have a children. Is this also part of the children's face? Yes. The giraffe. <laughs> okay? And one thing is that most of the time, especially when we start to train our children to brush the teeth, you ask them to speed up the toothpaste, is it easy or not? No. No, why? Because of the strawberry, watermelon, flavor, orange. They thought it's sweet, so they just sold it down. So that's why some of them they start to develop diarrhea, stomach upset problem. All this is because of the things they put inside the mouth. So one thing is that using the product, it must be safe for our family. That is why forever it doesn't have fluoride inside the toothpaste. No fluoride at all itself. So what is inside this toothpaste? Only three things. Aloe vera, bee propolis and chlorophyll. That is why it is green in colour. It's to give us a better breath. Okay? Don't, so you won't have bad breath. Lah. Then the other thing is that with aloe vera and bee propolis, the purpose is to what? Kill germs, antibacterial. 
So this is good for people with bleeding gums, sensitive teeth. Why I say so? My father-in-law, he has bleeding gums for 30 over years really because he was all along using all these other X-Brand products. So when we brought this back to him 5 years ago, right? To him it's like, how can this thing really help me? My problem is 30 over years really. But once he started to brush this, about, about uh, 1 week plus only, about 1 to 2 weeks only, his bleeding stopped. But for him, uh, as our elder, he don't believe one, so he used like this. Uh, and the bleeding starts to come back again. So once the bleeding starts to come back again, oh, then you know maybe it's, this thing really helps. So he used like this again. <laughs> and the bleeding stops. Okay? Until now, 5 years, he never changed it to face on you because this is the thing that helps him a lot. Okay? And another thing is that for people who, who like drink coffee with tea stains uh, or coffee stains or smokers, all you have to do is after you brush your teeth, you use this toothpaste to coat a layer outside your teeth. Wait for about 3 minutes later, then you rinse off. Mm. Okay? And next, we talk about price comparison. Mm. Oh, okay, yeah. And like, see, because of all of this, and some people like to use those what thing to gargle your mouth. I don't want to say what brand, like, you know, a lot of people use that one to gargle your mouth. Oh, what, what are the problems that will happen later? You all can see from all here. Okay, and plug. Ah, this toothpaste can also help to remain, remove all these kind of problems. Mm. Okay, so this toothpaste, after saying so good, it is $16.33 at retail. Who will buy? <laughs> Oh, you all say they're so supportive, you all never raise up. <laughs> <laughs> okay, but honestly, what really? what really? oh, but honestly, so <laughs> but honestly, if this thing left on the shelf, right, sixteen dollars the tree says some people without understanding, they may not accept it immediately because they will tell me, I buy this thing is only three four dollars only. But like I said, forever, uh, forever products is all very concentrated. You cannot squeeze like how you squeeze the normal toothpaste. Like the normal toothpaste, okay, your toothbrush, how long? For forever toothpaste, if you use, you just use this billet size only. Mm. Okay? So one toothpaste like this, you can use for about 270 tons. <coughs> but 270 tons is you squeeze out like that. Once you finish, cut open. You still can use at least 30 tons because me and my husband we tried it already. Really, you like that you still can use more. So it's roughly about six cents per usage. Comparing to other brands, it's about four cents, eight cents, three cents. It's not the cheapest, but it's not the most expensive. But most importantly, at the end of the day, what is the result we want? Okay? And let me ask you all, can toothpaste be eaten or not? No. No, toothpaste of course cannot be eaten. For the other brand. Ah. But for forever toothpaste, <laughs> it is safe to the extent that I mean, even if you are accidentally eat it or like children accidentally eat it, it is still okay. And then at times, right, if you really have a sore throat, like our dear videographer Amani, that time he also have a very bad sore throat. No, no, it is, he brings us to his office and it is very colleague. And then he shared with the colleague because this thing can help for sore throat. Yes. So the colleague also buys from him. <laughs> okay, so this is our toothpaste. So it's a multi-purpose. And some ladies also share this thing with me. If you all want, you can also use it as a family wash. Okay, if you want to know how, later then I'll share with you all. <laughs> okay? We have too many men here today. <laughs> okay, so after brushing your teeth, the next thing that what we all will do? Shower. Mm, wash face. Uh, yeah, shower or wash face, either one of it. But we go through the procedure. <laughs> Washing out the face, yeah. Okay, the liquid soap. Okay, anyone still using bar soap? <laughs> no. Ako. Yeah, Ako, Ako maybe use it. Okay, this is the tube form. And then, lastly, our liquid soap. So, I will be using three glass of water. You know, just now I show you all my testimonial at the top. I have very sensitive skin complexion. Mm. So this is one of the first few products my husband he said that hey, you use this, this is very good for your skin. The first thing that come across to me, I say, hey, don't want my skin very sensitive. I cannot anyhow use other brand products on. I'm very, very sensitive. But then he did he, he shared with me about this demo. And that's why I, I like about the products itself. Any product that you use and you feel that your skin is sensitive, you must test this thing called the mm. I left. Yeah, you have to test the pH. Okay? You have to test the pH of the 
uh, of the level of the product that you are actually using. If it is red in color, means it is what? Acidity. Oh, you forgot your size already. Okay. If it's red in color, means acidity. If it's blue, alkaline. alkaline. So water is what color? No color. No water is not green. Water is clear. <laughs> okay. The pH of water is green. Okay, which is pH seven. But let's test to make sure I never do anything to this three glass of water. Okay. So confirm water it is green. And hey, water is clear. <laughs> <laughs> so firstly, I will pour in the bar soap. Okay, next, this type of tube form which most people are using. And lastly, for all liquid soap. Okay, so let's take a look at the first one, the bar soap. What is the color? Alkaline. Yeah, blue is alkaline. This is the first one. Okay. So how about the next one? Okay, this tube form. Yeah, it is also alkaline. So normally when I do demo under this part, I would, I would normally ask them, uh, will you use this or you use this? Some people tell me I'll use this. But if you're still using this, right, honestly, I mean, from my heart, I'll change to this. You know why or not? This one 30 cents, this one 8 dollars. <laughs> <laughs> you spend the, the different amount, but you get the same results, man. So you spend something cheaper, right? <laughs> not like just joking, okay? You switch to this one. Why is it so? You take a look at our little so. It is neutral in color. Okay? This is neutral. So one thing is that this thing itself is pH, not only a pH balance, it's a pH balancer. Meaning when your skin is very dry, it can actually adjust back to normal. If your skin is very oily, it can also adjust back to normal. And the thing is that you see that it's written here for face and hands. When the first time I read this right, I got a shock. Maybe I got people used to wash hands, you know those hand soap to use to wash your face. Not possible, right? But you see, from head to toe, I'm covered all over except my face and hands. So remember, remember every day when you go back, you definitely have to wash your hands clean first, and you have to rinse off with water. Then you press the second time, wash your face. But most guys are, most guys are. I'm not saying the those here, okay? Most guys are like, how do you wash your faces like that? Wash your hands together and shoot your face. So all the dirt get back to the skin already, right? So you know, must two times. So one time for hands, one time for the skin. And why I like about Forever products so much is that all our first ingredient in our aloe vera series, right, is all aloe baba that Yes. Okay? For this one, it's a little bit small. So I must find someone whose eyes is very good. <laughs> okay? So maybe... Uh, uh, Megan, <laughs> Megan, what is the first ingredient here? Water. But how about the one that we have here? Alababadensis. Yes. Water, alababadensis. Y'all can pass around. Y'all can pass around and take it. Okay. So one thing is, we take a look at the price. First ingredient. Oh, oh, sorry. First ingredient, aloe vera itself, means that at least 80% of the product itself is aloe vera. Okay, so most of the product outside first ingredient is water. It means 80% of itself is water. You are buying is for what? Water? <laughs> so our pricing $31.31 for this bottle of 473 ml. If by 100 ml we make it into the same size as this, it is about $6.60. Okay? If you compare it to those normal brand outside, it's about the same price. But you can never compare the quality of forever products to this. Because we are not offering you water, we are offering you <laughs> genuine aloe vera itself. So that's why this is a very worth buying product that a lot of people love this. Okay? So this is for uh, the liquid soap. So next, after washing off your face, you bathe your body. Okay. So after you wash your face already, next you bathe your body. 